Hey everyone, today in this video we will create this type of cinematic title intro in Filmora. Another very easy cinematic intro to create. You can even find other cinematic intro tutorials on my channel. Please check them out. Now let's start today's video. First go to the stock media and from solid color drop the medium purple color on track 1. Then go to the color settings, change the temperature to minus 68. Tint to minus 23, Vibrance to minus 8, Saturation to minus 21, Exposure to minus 19, and Brightness to minus 1. Then drop the sample color 15 on track 2, go to the mask, select the circle mask, change scale to 89, height to 20, and then increase blur strength. Then go to the image and change the blend mode to overlay. Now go to the media and drop the thick atmosphere clip on track 3 and change the blend mode to overlay. Then select all the clips and create a compound clip. Then make a background 2 seconds and 15 frames long. Then go to the color setting, select HSL, select kind color, and change saturation to 31, luminance to 31, select the purple color, change hue to minus 70, saturation to 21, and luminance to 23. Then select curve, on alpha curve, add point on highlight and shadow, and create as curve. Then select the red curve, and pull it toward the kind color. Then select the blue curve, and from middle, push it slightly. Now from titles, place the default title on track 2. Make it 2 seconds and 15 frame long. Then click on advance. Change the font to RB number 2. Enter your word. Then increase letter spacing by 10. Change the fill to gradient. And add 2 points in the center of the gray color. Then change the black color to white and change the angle to 90 degrees to give a metallic look to the world. Adjust the title position. Now add another title, enter your word, change the font size to 40, adjust the position, then increase the letter spacing to 29, and click on apply. Then go to the video, at the start, change the scale to 1000, and on a keyframe. Then after 5 frame, change the scale to 75 and adjust the position. Then at the end, change the scale to 55. Now go to the media folder and apply a particle clip. You can download all the files from the link in the description. Make it as long as other clips and then change the blend mode to lighten. Then go to the adjustment layer and apply it on a top track. Make it as long as other clips. Then go to the color, change exposure to 6, brightness to 5, contrast to 33, highlight to 14, shadow to 8, black to 63, and then set sharpen to 5. Then select HSL, then select kind color, change hue to minus 5, saturation to 48, luminance to 43, and select the purple color, change hue to minus 51, saturation to minus 15, and luminance to 30. Then select the curve and adjust the alpha curve on highlight and shadow. Then select the color wheel and adjust the highlights to 1 and midtone to minus 0.27. Now to add flare, search the flare in stickers. Also, you can use this search bar to search effects, filters, stickers, templates, and titles. In titles, enter the title name like happy yellow and it will show you the happy yellow titles. In similar way, search for grunge metal production to get the grunge title. And even search for superhero and you will get these amazing superhero titles. Now you will get lots of options for flares. You can choose anyone that suits best to your title and the whole scene. Place the flare on top track. 
then at the fourth frame change the scale to 0 and on transform keyframe then at fifth frame adjust the scale to 40 and then at the end change position to the last letter and change scale to 30 then use color setting to make it red use hsl curve and light settings now apply the sharpen effect then apply the cinematic bar and change the bar height to 0.05 now our title is ready add your clip on track 1 then copy all the clips from title and paste them after your clip then select the default title change your word then adjust the flare position now select all the clips and create a compound clip on both titles now go to the stock media and place the black solid color at the end of first title on 2 seconds and 10th frame then at the start change the opacity to 0 and at the end change the opacity to 100 next you can use transitions like zoom transitions there are many zoom transitions you can choose any one of your choice that fit best to your creativity and you will get your awesome cinematic intro in filmora that easy to create cinematic intros in filmora if you like this video subscribe to my channel for more awesome tutorials check my other cinematic titles and intro tutorials see you all in my next video